Welcome to BIM Laser. So you click on the QR icon or you scanned it and you should reach this screen here and this file should open Borum Hill Greenwood development and I think this is pretty exciting I know uh, BIM 360 allows you to walk around the model but here with Autodesk Drive you can share a public link allowing for everyone to have access to your particular view so here I uploaded this is a Revit file and I uploaded it to Autodesk Drive and what we're gonna do right now is we're going to actually walk around so here you can see the interface you can actually change the the viewing uh, settings you could uh, click settings here and go to environment and you can change the way it's displayed on your screen and it's good to look at this or interact with this over your desktop but you could also do it with a tablet as well as a cell phone okay so if you go down to the bottom and click first person and click OK what what that allows you to do is to actually walk around the site so now here to the right you have a office and residential building and to the left you have a green incubator space and what we're gonna do is we're going to uh, briefly go inside now when you're in this environment and you're walking around you can actually teleport to different locations by double clicking on it okay so in this building it's a work in progress it's gonna be about eleven stories with solar panels on top it's a green incubator space uh, a herma actually a uh, hyper rapid manufacturing arm where uh, designs of technology can be manufactured right on site and it can be actually shown in a retail space below where the community can interact with it so it's just a unique uh, interesting design where you know the technology cycle in a local environment can sort of be uh, witnessed and appreciated so okay you have a glass sort of a trust uh, uh, called a sky bridge linking the two structures we have uh, electric charging on the top and again retail on the bottom so and we also have a uh, green space which some of you may have seen in other uh, tutorials that I've that I've uh, uploaded so what we want to do is let's very quickly teleport to the charging stations okay so up here these are electric Jeeps and here you can see how you can navigate and I'm just so excited about being able to walk around I've been trying to introduce virtual reality to architecture firms in New York City for the past 20 years so I'm excited to see that uh, Autodesk is doing this this is very 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 amazing to me okay so now we're in one of the cubicles over at the uh, green incubator space this is one of the work cubicles well it's not a cubicle it's actually a private office and here again if you remember from previous tutorials you can see okay let me get out of here I want to escape because I selected something okay now let's see teleporting into the space this is the in progress uh, conference room where the deals are made uh, some of you might remember that tutorial but now we're walking around in this space it's amazing okay this is the reception area I think we're on the fourth level and this is a two level uh, office space where uh, light manufacturing and green exploration research and development as well as uh, other offices can be located where a beautiful synergy can take place and uh, you know interesting ideas revolutionary technology and business approaches can actually be incubated and facilitated in spaces like these so again this is a work in progress as glass partitions going up again this is the conference area and so I just wanted to show you that you can actually walk around the space by uploading your files, Revit file, if it's an IFC file, to uh, Autodesk Drive. We're going to walk over the Sky Bridge right now, and once we do that, we'll be done. So, okay, we're leaving this structure here, and we're going over to the next structure. Okay, interesting, right? I didn't lay this out yet it's preliminary design so again I'll explain this design quick and then we're done I'm gonna jump off the building please do not do that in real life only in virtual reality okay <laughs> now you can see that this building is on stilts and the reason why this building is on stilts is because you have these these uh, entrepreneurial pods at the base 
and these entrepreneurial pods allow for the community to open up and this is a preliminary design allow for the community to open up their own uh, sort of entrepreneurial ideas they could uh, share a, a store you know two people two businesses could occupy these these types so essentially what this is a, allows for is that you could build on public or private property and raise your structure about 30 to 40 feet and still allow the community to have their own space where they could also engage in entrepreneurialism and development I mean they're not using uh, the people are not using uh, the air rights so you can occupy those air rights and just allow 40 feet for uh, the community to still uh, you know expand and and, and explore and uh, be the best that they can be so Again, uh, this is uh, this environment is Autodesk. Uh, if you can see, you could go. It's Autodesk Drive, and I'm pretty excited about it. This concludes this demonstration. Bim Laser.